Hi, I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Move Love, and I'm bringing you an explosive full body athletic workout. I have the awesome Rachel with me today. Hi. You guys, this is an all out workout. The type of workout when you wanna go all out, you wanna test your strength, you wanna test your agility, your balance, your coordination. You wanna train like an athlete in your home. This workout is for you. And Rachel's gonna be offering some awesome modifications to make this available to all levels, okay? So don't think you have to be able to like do everything. You take this workout where you're at and you can always scale up. That's what's so awesome about this one. You can come back and scale up. That's what we're here for. So your workout looks like this. You have a lot of exercises we're gonna go through that are gonna test your strength, your balance, your coordination. We're gonna go base, which is a strength move. You're gonna go build, you're gonna add some intensity to it, and then you're gonna go power, which is typically a powerful plyometric. You get to choose if you wanna jump, follow me. Don't wanna jump, follow Rachel. We have some dumbbells with us here, 20 pounds, 15 pounds. You can do this with your body weight or add some weights to increase the strength training. Each exercise is gonna be done for 30 seconds of work, followed by 15 seconds of rest. You ready to get warmed up? I'm so ready. She's so ready, I'm so ready. This is gonna be so fun. I was so pumped when I wrote this workout, you guys. I'm just real excited. This is like one of my favorite ways to train once a week just to feel like an athlete again. So whether you were one or you weren't one, it doesn't matter, you're an athlete today. Let's go ahead and get started with a warm up. My feet are underneath my hips. Give me a big inhale, reach up nice and tall. Right wrist grabs left, up and over, side body stretch to the right, nice. Bring it back to center, give me a calf raise, roll up to the toes, slow and control, roll back to the heels. Up and over, same thing, other side to the left, nice side body stretch. Bring it back to center, roll up to the toes, roll back to the heels. Let's do it one more time each way, big side body stretch. Back to center, roll up to the toes, roll back to the heels, same thing, up and over, other side. Back to center, last time, roll up, roll back. Go ahead, flap your wing, just open up the chest, shoulders, release any tension you're holding right there today. Nice. Awesome job. From here, give me a big inhale, reach up nice and tall, exhale, forward fold. Take the fingertips to your toes if that's available to you. Drop your hips, elbows fall to the inner thighs. Right arm to the ground, left arm up to the sky, gaze follows fingertips, roll up the wrist right here. Nice little thoracic spine rotation, nice. Switch it out, other side, left arm down, right arm up, gaze follows fingertips, roll it out, nice. Bring it back to center, both arms reach overhead, engage your core, stand up tall, do it again. Forward fold, reach for the toes, drop the hips, Take a couple squat wobbles here if you need to, opening up the hips. You're gonna move in those hips today, all directions. Right arm down, left arm up. Nice, roll at the wrist. Awesome job, switch it out, other side. Nice, go ahead, arms overhead. Can you stand up tall, engage the core? Awesome job from here, squat it out, get me down up. Let's go add some intensity, sitting those hips back. This is gonna be your base move. Any point in time today, you don't wanna do what we're doing, you just squat it out. When in doubt, we squat it out. You got it right here, chest is up. You got four, add a knee drive in three, nice. Two, last one, let's go. Right knee, woo, left knee, nice, pull it up. Boom, there you go. Drive it up, opposite hand, can you punch overhead? Boom, punch it, let's go. Push, come on, go five, nice. Four, you got it. Three, two, let's jack it out. Jack it out, Rachel's got the low impact with the taps. Jack it out, go eight, seven, six, you got it, five. Four, three, two, one. Hold it nice and wide. Push side to side. Hit those inner thighs. Go eight, seven, six. You got it. Five, four, three, two, one. Hands to the ground. Nice wide leg forward fold. Walk your feet underneath your hips. Step back. Find a high plank. Nice. Shoulders stacked over the wrist. Core is nice and tight. Pull up on the kneecaps. Push back on the heels. Awesome job. Hold here. Give me two push ups. Lead with the chest. Down. Up. Down, up, right foot outside, right hand, easy twist. Three shoulder sweeps to the back. One, two, three, plant the hand, switch it out, other side, left foot outside, left wrist, easy twist, three shoulder sweeps. One, two, three, set it down. Drive your knees towards your chest, slower, fast, you climb it out for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, one. Step your right foot, your left foot, stand up tall, you ready to do this thing? We're gonna jump in and continue the warm up as we start the workout. Your first circuit is seven body weight mobility exercises, continuing to warm up your body, your shoulders, your chest, your core. We're gonna jump into those, okay? So you're just gonna follow along. You're gonna do each exercise once, repeating sides as needed. 30 seconds of work per ex exercise, 15 seconds of rest. So it's gonna go fast, okay? Hit pause when you need to, take breaks when you need to. 
Let's crank it out. We're gonna test your mind and your muscles today. I'm gonna show you your first move. It's an Everest climber, right? So I'm gonna find that nice high plank position. Just like we did in the warm-up, I'm gonna set my right foot outside my right hand. I'm gonna climb, so I'm gonna switch my feet by hopping. One, two, three, hold with an easy twist. And then you're gonna do it again for three. One, two, three, hold with an easy twist. Rachel's gonna show you the modification. She's gonna be stepping in versus jumping. Follow Rachel when you need to. Stick with me if you can. 30 seconds per move. Let's continue to warm up. You're on in three, two, let's go, let's go. So it's one, two, three, hold and twist. Rachel and I are gonna move at different paces, right? One, two, three, hold and twist, okay? She's gonna be stepping, so it's a different pace. You do your pace. You don't have to stick with us. You're moving for 30 seconds. Your 30 seconds, okay? Make the most of it. Just continuing to open up the hips here, warm up the core, the chest, the shoulders. We gotta get nice and warm before we jump into these explosive movements. You got it, you got it, right here. Come on, five seconds. Finish it, drop to tabletop in three, two, one. Nice work, tabletop. Take your right arm, bend it at 90 degrees. You are going to do a bird dog, but you're gonna to go to the side. So I'm lifting this arm to the side, this leg to the side. Bring it in, lift and lower. Bent knee, bent leg. Gonna warm up your posterior chain. Ready, three, two, let's go. Lift and lower, lift and lower. So my right knee stays on the mat, my left hand stays on the mat. Opposing, right arm stays bent, left leg stays bent. Woo, you feel this? Yeah, core. Hello core, right? Hello core. You guys, we are gonna work in so many different planes today, challenging your coordination, your agility, I am so pumped. But first, we gotta get nice and warm. Gotta make sure your body's ready to move like an athlete. 10 seconds, let's go. Preparation, your mind's gotta get in it, right here, get in it, come on. Let's go, you're here for four, three, two, one. Nice work, set it down. We're gonna go back into a plank. You're gonna find a high plank. You're gonna alternate reaching your hand in front of you. Just reach and reach. We're gonna work on core stability right here. Enjoy that rest, whoo, soak it in. Ready? Option, take your plank from your knees or your toes. Alternating reach out, set it up. You're on in three, two, let's go. So reach your right hand out. Now reach your left hand out, there you go. Just alternating reaches. Pretend like you're reaching for something in front of you. If you wanna put a dumbbell out there, go for it. The point here is to keep the hips square and stable to the ground. Stabilize the core. The core is meant to stabilize you as your limbs move in multiple directions, right? Right here, you're moving front and back. Nice, sagittal plane. We're gonna move in the sagittal plane, the frontal plane, side to side, and the transverse plane, pivoting and rotating. You're gonna get it all today. Right here, stay with me, five, Four, three, two, one. Nice work, set it down. You're gonna do tabletop. Same thing, other side, right? Bent arm, left arm is bent. Right leg, lift and lower. So my left knee's on the mat, my right hand is on the mat. Bent arm right here on the left, we lift and lower. Bird dog, gonna warm up that posterior chain. Right here, you ready? Three, two, let's go. Lift and lower. Again, you're gonna take all these moves at your pace, your tempo. Some of these moves you're never gonna have tried before, probably. So it might be your first time doing it. Show yourself some grace, right? Show yourself some grace right here. This move, it's a lot harder than it looks. Truly. Truly harder than it looks. Come on, come on. It's just different, too. Different, right? Different. Can we just commend Rachel? You guys all said, bring Rachel back. She is here. She is back. You guys wanna see more Rachel, you get more Rachel. Right here, come on. Right here, you go. Five, four, three, two. Give me one more. Up, nice work. From here, we're gonna go to our backside, okay? You're gonna find a forearm plank. So you're gonna come lying on your back. Arms are bent below you. Shoulders down, out of the ears. Option A, knees stay bent. Rachel's gonna hold here. You're just lifting your hips. You're gonna work that posterior chain. Option B, legs extend away from your body. Lift up in three, two, let's go. This is just a reverse plank hold. It's gonna challenge you, right? Hello, shoulders, gonna open up your chest. This feels uncomfortable. Go ahead, you can find a reverse plank this way. You can get that full extension. Fingertips face your butt. Okay, you can come right here. That's gonna give you more. But this forearm plank is harder, right? It's harder, there's not a lot of space to lift. You're not lifting high, you're just getting your butt off the mat. You're gonna feel your hamstrings fire up, your back fire up, Hello, low posture your chain. Come on, keep a nice long neck, keep breathing. Yes, you can. Hold here, come on, five, four, three, two, and one, you're up. Are you ready for your final move? I'm gonna grab my towel. It looks like this, final move, final body weight mobility. You're gonna hold a low squat, you're just holding here. I'm gonna drop this towel. When it hits the ground, you explosively stand up or you explosively jump. If you wanna leave the ground, you're jumping, okay? Watch the towel, hand-eye coordination, right here, get low. Hold your squat, three, two, 
Let's go. So you're just holding a squat. Weights in your heels, chest is up. Just holding right here. When you see this towel hit the ground, you stand up. Rachel's gonna stand, I'm gonna jump. You ready? Let's test it out. Here we go, go. Come on, get low, get low. Just hold, hold, go. Get low, get low, hold, hold, hold. Nice, go. Hup. Come on, come on. Gotta get you nice and warm right here. Let's go, hold it. Let's go, go. Hup. Come on, hold it. 10 seconds, come on, yes you can. You're gonna go three ups, ready? Up, down, up, down. Last one, up, down, here out. Woo. You warm, Rachel? Yeah. Grab some water. Who's ready for some fun athletic moves? Your workout looks like this, okay? That's just the warm up, that's the fun stuff. Now we get into the really good stuff, okay? You have three circuits. Your first circuit is gonna be squats and agility. We're gonna focus on the legs, goblet squats. You go base, which is build. You go, I'm sorry, you go base, which is strength. You go build, which adds a little intensity, and then you go power, typically body weight plyometric. Okay, follow Rachel if you don't wanna jump. I'm gonna show you your first move. One dumbbell, go heavy if you can, holding it right here at your chest. Good goblet squat. Who doesn't love a goblet squat, right? We love them. Lowering down, standing up tall. You're gonna do it for 30 seconds, you're gonna rest for 15 seconds, and then you're gonna do it again. You're gonna repeat each move times two, switching sides as needed. Just holding a dumbbell, a kettlebell right here at your chest should actively engage your core, your chest, your shoulders. Nice work, okay, I'm just gonna let my timer match up here. You're gonna sit back into squats for 30 seconds. Ready, Rachel? She's ready, let's go. Squat it out in three, two, let's go. Squat, stand, good goblet squat right here, down up. Nice, I should have said take more, take more warm up if you need it, you can always hit the timer. I don't know about you, but I got a little sweat going. I know, I'm warm. Right? My heart's going, hips right? nice and open. Nice, we got you all pumped up and we're like, now we're gonna goblet squat, <laughs> I promise. It's gonna build and it's gonna get more and more fun with each rep. Just right here, down up. Knees go out towards the pinky toes, stand tall. You gotta do the basics before you can do the really fun stuff. Nice, 10 seconds. I'm gonna tell you a really, really fun story about my own athletic journey. I'm just kidding, it'll be something. Here we go, three, two, one. You're gonna rest for 15 seconds and then you're just gonna do that again, okay? After I had my first kid, I was super motivated. I was like, I'm gonna get back. I'm doing 10 pull-ups. I'm gonna train like an athlete again. And I did. Then I had my second kid and I was like, who needs to do pull-ups? I'm a mom now. I don't do pull-ups and I don't need to be strong. You're on in three, two, let's squat. I was like talking myself out of this. I was like, that's just, I don't even need to do that because I felt so incapable. I was weak. I had to start over again. It's a process. I knew it was gonna take time. And I was just like, I don't, who cares? I don't want to. And let me tell you, I was just telling myself lies because it felt impossible, but it's consistency. I started doing it, I got better, and now I'm like, heck yes, mama too, I will crank out some pull-ups for you, right? Yes. Come on. We got so much tutorial for that. Oh yeah, we do. Right here, come on, five seconds. You're squatting for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. So you do your best where you're at is the moral of the story. Same thing, add a heel tap, right heel, squat, right heel taps left, stand up. Squat, right heel taps left. Working on agility and load transfer. Agility and load transfer. Right heel taps left. You're there in three, two, let's go. So squat, hold, tap, stand. Squat, hold, tap, it's only 30 seconds. You're gonna do each side, each side once, that's it. Each side once. Nice work, come on. So I'm transferring the load into the left leg, right? Working on the agility. Can I pull the opposing right leg in? Hello inner thighs, hello adductors, hello low back, hello core. If this is too much for you, you drop the weight. You do this body weight right here, okay? Make this a body weight exercise. 10 seconds, let's go. Come on, finish it right here. You got five, four, three, two, and one. Stand up, shake it off. Same thing, other side. Left heel taps opposing right heel. Again, you make it a body weight exercise, okay? 10 seconds, you're on. Catch your breath. Right here, we're squatting again. A lot of squats. Let's go. In three, two, let's go. You feel the heart rate already rising, Rachel? I hear you breathing back there. It's I'm like, strength, I know, but my heart's going. That's what we want. That's what we want. Come on, 30 seconds per move. You can do anything for 30 seconds. Yes, you can. This next round, I'm gonna drop my dumbbell. We go power. This is your build. We did base goblet squats. Build, add the agility, the load transfer, power. Woo, that's where we go next. You got it, let's go, 10 seconds, come on. Stay with me. Nice work, you guys. Right here, finish it. Five, four, three, two, you're out. I'm gonna go dumbbell down. 
Rachel's gonna stay with the build move. That's where she's gonna stay. I'm gonna go power. That right heel is gonna come back in. Right heel tap, I'm gonna explode. I jump, add a jump to each one. Or don't, just stand up with Rachel. You gonna keep the dumbbell? I'm gonna keep it for now, we'll see. You gonna keep it. Three, two, let's go. Squat, tap it, power. So you decide, what are you gonna do for 30 seconds? It's your workout. Base, build, power. Base, build, power. Train like an athlete, right here. Come on, come on. You got it, woo! Hello legs, hello legs, there they are. Don't worry, your neck circuit's arms. Your neck circuit's arms, woo! Woo, these legs are fiery. Yes, they are, come on. Get it, get it. Let's go, team. Let's go, fire it up for five, four, three, two, one more. Ah, woo, that's fire. Same thing, other side, right? Left heel taps right. Left heel taps right. Woo, you can raise your heart rate. This, this is my playground right here. This is why we train, right? We do this really fun stuff. Really, really fun stuff. Left heel taps right heel. You ready? Three. Two, let's go. Add the jump or don't. You decide, come on. Your workout. Let's go, let's go. Push yourself today. What do you got? What does your inner athlete look like? Come on, let's see it. Right here. So many of you guys have reached out saying it feels so good to train like an athlete in your own home. I wanna push that. I wanna push the envelope. Come on. You can do more than you think you can. Right here. Give me five, four, three, two, and you're out. Whew. Nice work. Grab water. Recover. Circuit one done. Circuit two, we move on. Arms. Whew. Rest. Okay. Quality rest between each circuit. So you can get back to where you need to. Okay. Base. Single arm row. Right here. Do you have lighter weights? Go ahead, give me a double arm row. You got a heavy weight, go single arm. Here you go, single arm row. 30 seconds on the right, 30 seconds on the left. Build, you add a snatch. One row, one snatch. Rachel's gonna give you a high pull or an upright row. It's your mod, your modification, okay? And then, your power, I like to know what's coming. One row, one snatch, two push press. Dip drive, dip drive. So we go back, total body, shoulder. Back, total body, shoulder. Ready to do it, Rachel? I'm so ready, what a Jeez. move. <laughs> what a move. Okay, we start, with, we start with your base. You'll get the hang of it. Start with the single arm row. Don't bite off more than you can do, just chip away. Single arm row, feet are gonna stay parallel. Pull that belly tight, grab the dumbbell in your right hand. You're rowing in three, two, let's row. Up and down. Pull from the elbow, right back to the rib cage. Elbow mates, rib cage, stop. Hold at the top for a second. Slow control, lower. Hold, slow control, lower. So Rachel's got a nice staggered stance. If you feel this in your low back, Take that staggered stance, or keep the feet parallel, you do you, right here. Option, you can take this opposing hand, you can find a bench right here, right? You can find a nice little bench, put it on. If you feel this in your low back, that's one of the big complaints we get from you guys, find a bench. Support yourself, stabilize yourself, strengthen that core. Let's go right here, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Set it down, shake it out. Same thing, other side. You're gonna row on the left, okay? Now we row on the left. Then we're gonna add the snatch on the right. Just base, base right here. Get the base, then you build it. Base, then you build it. I love it. Pick up your dumbbell. Row on the left in three, two, let's row. Up and down. 30 seconds on, 15 seconds off. We're gonna move really fast, you guys. Really fast. Gonna challenge your mind and your muscles right here. Woo, come on. Putting some big upper body moves together right here. Give the legs a break, because trust me, you're gonna get the legs next, and it's gonna be fire. All right? You got it. It's like a promise and a threat. I know! <laughs> oh, it is. You're so right, Rachel. So right. Best way to describe it. 10 seconds, let's go. Come on. Pull up and down. Keep that shoulder square to the ground. Hold at the top. Five, four, three, two, one. Set it down. Same thing, back to the right arm. This time you add your snatch. So it's one row, drive through the hips, heels pop off the ground, dumbbell stays tight to the body like I'm zipping up a zipper all the way up top, lock it out. Rachel's gonna give you a nice upright row. Grab your dumbbell. You're on in three, two, let's go. One row, one power snatch. So I go, palm in on the row, palm face me on the snatch. Okay, palm in, snatch. See how my heels pop off the ground? It's power, it takes work to get this 20 pound dumbbell overhead. Boom, 
boom, shoulder drop, row, snatch, power right here. Give me the back, the total body and the shoulder right there, 10 seconds, come on. You got it, yes you can. Nice work, gonna start to raise that heart rate, right? Boom, let's go, big power moves right here. Five, four, three, two, finish it. Boom, same thing other side. Rest and recover, same thing other side. One row, one snatch. Rachel's got the nice upright row for you, right? Woo, all right, working hard you guys. Let's do it, moving on. Build on the left in three, two, let's go. Give me the row, the snatch. Palm in, palm face me. Now you don't have to stick with my pace, you do your pace, right? Okay, you got heavy weight, you go slow and steady. These are big power moves. Big compound athletic movements right here. Boom, and snatch. Think about getting underneath that weight. Catch it, soften in the knees. You got it. Row, snatch, dumbbell stays close to the body. Zip it up, let's go, 10 seconds. You got it, right here. Boom, and boom, heart rate's rising. Five, four, three, two, you're out. Whew. Nice work, same thing, same movement. Now we add on a double push press. So I have a heavy weight, dip, drive, dip, drive. If you have a lighter weight, you can give me a strict press. Two presses. Let's go, grab it with the right. Row, snatch, two press, press, two pull, pull. You're on in three, two, let's go. Row, snatch, two push press, dip, drive, dip, drive. Stay on the right, right here. Row, snatch, push, push, come on, right here. Row, snatch, this is your power, push, push, come on, it's power right here. Row, snatch, push, push, nice. Rachel's moving a little bit slower, right, because she's Breaking down the movement for you. Push, push, come on, you got this, let's go. Five, four, three, two, one. Set it down, Woo. Hello, that'll raise the heart rate. Yeah. Same thing, other side. Now you know how to do it, you're gonna master it on this left arm. One row, one snatch, two push press, okay? You're working for that break before we hit the legs again. Grab your dumbbell, you're on in three, two, let's go. Row, snatch. Push, push, it's a tiny two inch dip drive. Row, snatch, push, push, right here. This is the fun stuff, right? The stuff you work really hard for, you build foundational strength so you can do this. Option is always to stick with your base move or stick with your build move. You don't have to go to power, not today. You do your best, right? When I was doubting myself in those push-ups, I was probably at base, that's okay. You build the base, you move to build, you go to power, come on. Let's go, three, two, finish it, finish it, out, Whew. recover, grab water. Nice, that's power for you right there. All right, Rachel, you ready to move on? Mm -hmm. Ready to move on. I love it because it almost feels like a no repeats workout, you know? It does, you're going quick. Yeah. I mean, you're moving, right? Okay, you guys, this is the last base build power circuit. And then we go all out body weight agility, woo. Get excited. Reverse lunges. First move is a good old step back lunge. Okay, so I'm just step back lunge, step back lunge. You could hold one dumbbell at your chest. You're gonna do that twice. And then I'm gonna go to one dumbbell, probably. You're gonna step back lunge, hold, hop. Rachel's gonna do a pulse. Alternate, step back, hop, stand tall. Adding a little hop at the bottom. And then circuit three, I'm just not even gonna tell you what's coming. I'm not gonna tell you. You're gonna have to wait for it because I don't want you to turn off the TV. I don't want you to turn off your phone. Circuit three is just really fun power. You're gonna challenge yourself, you're gonna try new moves. It's gonna be awesome. Grab your dumbbells, step back lunges. Are you ready? Step back lunges in three, two. Let's go, Rachel, step back right. Oh, that's okay, we can be off, it doesn't matter. Yeah. There we go, it doesn't matter. Oh, we're so different. It doesn't matter, right? <laughs> Everybody has their unique individuality. Also left and right, like. I know, I mean. It's so hard for us. <laughs> Yeah, my, my left and rights are always backwards. You guys know I'm mirroring you, so when I say right, that's really my left. It's like this funny game I play with my kids because when I try and teach them left, right, I'm always wrong. <laughs> right here, come on, 10 seconds on the step back lunges. You gotta go heavy, Woo! Come on, come on. Hello legs, there they are. Let's go, five, four, three, two, one. Set them down. And do that same thing. Again, step back lunges, repeat it. 30 seconds per move, goes fast, right? Get to know it. We're gonna add the hop at the bottom, second time through on the build. 
Woo, grab the dumbbells, you're on. Three, let's step back right in two, one. There we go, now we got it. Hey, there it is. Woo, nice, awesome. I say it doesn't matter, but the slight weird perfectionist in me is like, oh, but it does. It does a little. But it doesn't, you guys, it doesn't. <laughs> I'd say this, I have chilled out with each child. Each kid has chilled me out a little bit. It's been good for me. Mama could use a chill pill, okay? Perfectionism holds us back sometimes, right? Come on, 10 seconds. With working out, do your best, you forget the rest. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're just here and you're moving for five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. Set them down. I'm gonna go to one dumbbell. I'm gonna show you this without a dumbbell because my legs are feeling it. Whew. Okay, step back right, hold, hop. Stand tall. Rachel's gonna give you a pulse. Step back left, hold, hop. Whew. I'm gonna hold one dumbbell. You can do this with just your body weight. Okay, you're there. In three, two, let's go. Step back, hold, hop at the bottom. Whew. Stand tall. Step. Rachel's giving you a pulse. Let me give you a little hop. 30 seconds. Yes, you can. Right here. Whoo, hello, legs. There they are. Nice. Starting to get nice and fiery, right? It's a good thing. Whew, they're active. I'll tell you that much. Whew. Come on, come on. You got it, you got it. Right here. One rep at a time. Let's go. What would it look like if I said 10 more seconds? Stay with me. You got this. Right here. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. Set it down. Same thing. Same thing. Whew. I like it because you get to like do it and do it again. Get the hang of it. Do it better. 15 second rest, it's like it doesn't even exist. Whew. Catch the breath. I'm nervous for what's coming. I'm just gonna tell you right now. Hold it at your chest, let's go. Step back with a hop in three, two, let's go. I showed up today to challenge myself though, right? I think we're all a little bit stronger than we think we are, right? Adrenaline just kicks in. Sometimes it takes over. You gotta push yourself, that's why you hit play today. You weren't just gonna do some crazy ninja moves on your own at home, no? You are like, let's see what Lindsay's up to today, right? Come on, right here, let's go. You got it, you got it, 10 seconds. 10 seconds, stay with me. Nice work, Woo. Let's go, you're in at five, four, three, two, you're out, I'm going body weight, okay? You're gonna stay, right leg forward, left leg back, I'm gonna show you from the side. Rachel's gonna give you a nice lunge, power. Option, you can add that lunge drop, okay? I'm gonna give you a scissor kick, Ooh, what? I know, lunge, scissor. It's gonna be pure fire. Okay, it's gonna stink, but we're gonna do it. Okay, 30 seconds, let's go. Three, two, try something new today. So I'm trying to kick that back left leg up to my right leg, oh my goodness. And I gotta do this for 30 seconds. Who wrote this? Who wrote this? Holy bananas, holy bananas, Woo! Come on, ah, I gotta take a break. Woo! Five, four, three, two, come on, go Lindsay, let's go, let's go. Ah. You got it. Come on, stay in it. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> That's it, you guys. That's what we're working for today. Whew. Nice work. We gotta do it on the other side. 15 second rest, you do it on the other side, then you get a water break. You understand me? Do it and then water break. Whew. Just gonna breathe. Left leg forward, right leg back. Let's go, three, two, let's go. I get that left foot. Ooh, it feels weirder on this side. What am I doing? There we go. One side's more coordinated than the other. Ah. Okay, five, four, three. See how I caught myself? Only five seconds. That's all I get. Gotta get back in. Come on. Come on. Ah. Let's go. Right here. You got it. Yes, you Come can. On. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Holy bananas. There you go, Liz. Holy bananas. Nice work, Rachel. Holy bananas. Holy bananas. Okay, you guys, grab some water. That's the tip of the iceberg. I'm just kidding. Now we go all out body weight cardio. I'm gonna push you today. I'm gonna push you today. One more sip of water because Oli bananas. That was Oli, 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 Oli. Oli. <laughs> That's Midwest for you. <laughs> if you didn't know, I'm from Minnesota. <laughs> and uh, I'm dying right now because those scissor jumps really killed me. Um, <laughs> but one day I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna get all 30 seconds. You just wait. Okay, you guys, this is what it looks like. We are going into your final circuit. Okay, this is it. All out. Whatever gas you have left in your tank, you pour it out right here, okay? It's all body weight. It's all agility and strength, okay? So your first move, 
is a push up. So you're gonna do one push up, and then you're gonna you're only you're doing it 30 seconds. You're gonna get a 30 second rest, except caveat, maybe not. Sometimes, okay. <laughs> sometimes you'll get a break. Sometimes you won't. I'll just stop talking about the the break. This is the move. You're gonna give me one push up, and then you're gonna give me either eight mountain climbers. This is Rachel. Or if you're with me, you're gonna climb to the right. So it's rotation for four. One, two, three, four. Back, two, three, four. So I'm swinging my legs out to the right side for a four count, a four count rotational climber. You ready? Set it up. You're on in three, two. Let's go. Give me the one push up. I'm going out two, three, four. Back, two, three, four push up. Rachel's doing eight climbers, just standard. Climbing out to the side, hello obliques, forcing them to work. One push up. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Back, two, three, four. Ooh, I got dropped to the knees. Push up. Come on. One, two, three, four. Back, two, three, four. Let's go. You're here for five, four, three, two, one. Hold push up. No break. Just hold push up. I'm going to go to my knees. You do your best. Come on, hold push up. Maybe you can do your toes. Maybe you can take it up to an incline. I'm on the struggle bus right now. Total transparency. I'm just gonna give you my best 30 seconds of push-ups. You get a 30 second break after this, okay? Come on. This is where you build mental toughness right here. As an athlete, you gotta build mental toughness. Right here, one move to the next. One minute of work, it's hard. Push-ups stink, they're really hard. But you get better at them, let's go. You're so much stronger than you think. Come on, five, four, three, two, one. Sit it back. Break for 30 seconds. Stay on your knees. Rachel is going to give you a prisoner get up. Hands behind the head. She's going to step right foot, left foot, stand up. Okay? That's her move. Right foot is always the lead foot. We're going to do it again where your left foot will lead. You want something else? Ninja get up, baby. Saw me do this in my slippers. I got sneakers on now, so it's going to get really good. I'm going to hike my hips back, and then I'm going to pop up right there to get down, down. Then I'm going to sit back, hike up. My feet are going to come underneath me and catch myself. Ready? Let's do it. Three, two, one. It's 30 seconds. Yes, you can. Move like an athlete right here. Let's go. If there's one move. I think about falling on my face on it's probably this one. Especially when my legs are tired from those scissor jumps. But this right here, this is my playground. This is why I train. I was practicing this move in my slippers. My son goes, that's really cool. I want to do that. And I was like, yeah, baby. Mom can do that. Five, four, three, two, one. Whew. That makes me feel strong. Probably the strongest ever. Because when my son looks at me and says, my mom is really strong. She can do that. Mom is cool. Mom's cool. Because she can do ninja get-ups. I told him what they're called. I said, buddy, these are ninja get-ups. He was like, yeah. Where my ninja mom's at? Where my ninja mom's at? You're here. Okay, we're repeating those moves. Okay? One push-up. Rotational climber to the left or eight climbers. One push up. Try and stay on my toes for these ones. Okay, let's go. Three, two, let's go. One push up. Rotational climber. Three, four, back, two, three, four. One push up. Climb. Two, three, four, back, two, three, four. Come on. One push up. Climb. Two, three, four, back. If it feels funky, that's normal. You got it. Climb. Two, three, four. So challenge your body to move agility in different directions. One, transverse plane, twisting. Let's go. You got this. Come on, five, four, three, two, one. Hold your push-up, let's go. Ha, ah, 30 seconds of push-ups. Mentally tough, right here. Mentally tough. That's what you are. Knees or toes, incline, I don't care. Just keep moving. You need a break, you take three seconds, you get right back. You need a break, you take three seconds, you get right back. Let's go, come on, come on. Let's go. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. Right here. I'm going to push you 10 seconds. Don't quit. Don't quit. Not now. Five, four, three, two, and one. Push back. Okay? You should hit the point where you want to quit. You want to tap out, but you're not going to because you're stronger than that. Grab some water. 30 seconds rest. Okay? Ninja get ups. If you're with Rachel, Left foot leads, okay? Left, right, stand up. If you're with me, ninja get up. Let's go, okay? 10 seconds, soak it in, catch your breath. Come on, come on, dig deep. Got some fire in here, I know you do. Three, two, one. It's a song. What can I do with this fire on the inside? My song right here, that's where I go, right here. Come on, I get after it. 
Let that fire go. Come on, right here. You are strong. You are tough. You are capable. Do your best. Forget the rest. Come on, come on. Nice work, Rachel. Awesome job. 10 seconds, you guys. 10 seconds. Yes, you can. Finish it. Five, four, we're gonna get one more. Three, two, one. Woo! There it is. All right, you guys. Four moves. Four moves. Buy in right here. Say yes, I can. Four moves. Say yes, I can. Okay? Plank kicks it. Rachel's gonna give you a kick sit. Tabletop position. She's gonna open to her right. Left foot kicks through. You can tap your foot. She's gonna keep kicking that way. I'm gonna do a plank kick sit. I'm going to step my right hand outside my right, I gotta just do it. Boom, kick. Right hand outside, right foot. Okay, he'll get it. Three, two, option, follow Rachel, option. Boom, boom. So, outside leg plants, inside leg kicks. Outside leg plant, inside leg kicks. 30 seconds. Ah, think about it. that hip's gonna brush the mat. Oh, hello shoulders. Hello core. Holy bananas. It burns, I know. Halfway. How you doing, Rachel? Take a break when you need to. Get back in. Ah, the goal of this workout is push. Come on, five, four, three, two, one. You gotta push yourself. You gotta push yourself every now and then. Find those new limits. Find new limits, set new limits. Oh, we've done this before. Come up to standing. Okay? Fun one. Right leg. Bouncing on my right leg. Front, back, skate. Bring it back. Front, back, skate. So it's like there's a line right here. I'm hopping over it. Single leg hop, skater. Rachel's gonna do a lateral lunge. You guys, come on, three moves. Yes, you can. Dig deep right here. Let's go, front, back, skate in three, two, let's go. Front, back, skate, come on, agility. Hop, hop, drive, power. Put it all together, core, coordination. Come on, yes you can. Stick with me or follow Rachel. You do you. Let's go right here. You guys are so awesome. You're so brave for putting hit and play on this workout. I'm so proud of you. Yes, I am. Come on, come on. Right here, yes, you can. Come on, dig it, dig deep. Pour it out, pour it out. Push it. Come on, let's go. Three, two, one. There it is. Okay, repeat those two moves and you're done. That's it. Rest for 30 seconds. Okay, come on. And find that tabletop. Find that tabletop right here. Okay, you're gonna open up, kick through if you're with Rachel. If you're with me, you're in a plank. Okay, left foot outside, left hand. Right, kick through on the right. And when I feel myself like, me, my husband and I just watched Lone Survivor. That movie always reminds me, man, Navy SEALs are tough. I wanna be so tough like that. Okay, come on. Three, two, let's go. When I'm breathing like this, I'm like kind of wheezing. Reminds me of the one guy. He has just fought. He's gotten shot in the head twice. He has like, he's insane and he keeps going. He keeps going because he has fight. He's got a fight in him like none other. That's a fight like I want to have. I want to have that kind of fight. Come on, let's go. Find it right here. Find it. Yes, you can. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Ooh, it burns, I know. I'm with you. Let's go five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! This is it, you guys. This is it. That heart, it should be thumping. Whew. You should be so grateful you got one healthy heart inside you. Okay? Heart disease is the number one killer of women. Yeah, believe it or not, it is. It's kind of crazy. You're doing something really good today. Balancing on your left leg. Jump that line. Front, back, skate. Right here. Front, back, skate. That's what you're going. Come on. This is it. What do you got, Rachel? Let's go. Let's get Let's it. Let's get it. Come on, front, back, skate in three, two, let's go, let's go. Front, back, skate, come on, 30 seconds. This is the dirty 30. This is it, your best effort yet. Come on, show me that fire on the inside. What can I do with this fire on the inside? Oh man, I wish we could play some awesome copyright music. <laughs> right here, come on, let's go. Push it, come on, come on. 10 more seconds. Yes, you can, finish with me. Finish, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! There you go, Lens. Nice work, Rachel. Not gonna lie, I'm glad it's over. I'm glad it's over, that pushed me today. Grab some water. That is hands on knees, gasping for air. Earned it, 
work for it. Hello, athlete. That's you. Way to show up and work. Let's stretch, Rachel. Let's stretch. The best part. The best part. Come down to tabletop position. I'll go this way. As you can see me. Just catch your breath right here. Take a couple cat cows. Let the belly drop. Lift the chin towards the ceiling. Reverse it. Tuck the spine towards the ceiling. Pull the chin towards the chest. It's one of those workouts where my leggings look like I peed my pants. I swear it's sweat. Just sweat. I got a good pelvic floor. I've been working on it. <laughs> Tuck it up. Nice work. Give me one more. Drop the belly. Nice. Pull it up. Now find that nice neutral spine. Nice neutral spine right here. Put the big toes to touch. Open up the legs. Before you sit back, take your right hand out. Place your left hand on top. Oh, sorry. Put your left hand across the body on the right. Place your right hand on top of it. Then sit back. Okay, so it's like a cross body stretch. Nice. This should feel so good for your low back. Just opening everything up. You guys are so awesome. I'm so proud of you. I gotta say, you guys give me that fire on the inside. Come back up, switch it out. Right hand over to the left, left hand on top, sit back. There is just sweat burning in my eyeballs right now and it feels so good. One of those times where you're like, I worked my butt off for that. Nice work. You guys always, I can't stop blinking. You guys always show up ready for probably like the greatest challenge ever. It just makes me so happy and so inspired to keep bringing you guys such tough workouts. I'm so proud of you, okay? Nice, let's kick those legs out in front of you. Okay, flex your toes towards your face. Tuck your hips back towards that wall behind you. Big inhale, reach up. Slightly hinge forward, push those hips back. Pull the toes towards the face. Hold it here for three, two, one. Now go ahead, release. Let it all hang heavy. Reach for those toes. That should feel so, so good. Nice long body stretch. Awesome job. And this is one of those workouts where if I was looking at this postpartum five months, six months, I'd be like, I don't need to do that. Who cares? I don't need to be an athlete. And that's my own like inner self telling me because it feels so hard, but you just chip away. Show up, start with a good strength workout. Build foundational strength and then come back and build up to this, okay? You do your best with where you're at. Can't emphasize that enough. Okay, Rachel, let's finish it. Right here, you're gonna find a reverse tabletop because it feels so good. Fingertips face my butt. Legs are bent at 90 degrees. Lift your hips high, drop your neck. Just let it hang heavy, push those hips high. Nice work, you guys. Nice work, just hold here. Open up the front side of the body. Should feel so, so good. Hold for three, two, one. Sit those hips back. I am. So stinking proud of you guys. Awesome work. Thanks for showing up. I hope you come back and do this one again. Progressively get better. A great way to measure your strength, your coordination, your agility, all that stuff. And as always, if you like this workout, drop a subscribe on our channel. We'd love it and appreciate it so much. And we'd also love to see you back for more workouts at nourishmovelove.com. Have a good day.